college is where students grow into professionals, ideas transform to reality, and leaders come to life. So take advantage, UConn, because this is your time. I'm Tiffany St. Bernard. I am a biology major. I'm graduating in 2012 and I'm from East Granby, Connecticut. MetaMentor is a nonprofit organization with the mission of inspiring, encouraging, and supporting women and minorities that are interested in the STEM field, so that's science, technology, engineering, mathematics. I'm the vice president and COO, and I oversee stuff and I help with the development and growth of the organization. We match middle and high school students with college A's mentors via video conferencing and emailing and stuff like that. Many mentors allows you to be a mentor without having the inconvenience of having to drive or go anywhere. You can be a mentor from the convenience of your own house. For the mentee, they're able to be matched with multiple mentors. That's where the name came about, is Many Mentors. We hope to expand Many Mentors to be at least in the New England region and then eventually nationwide. I know I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for mentors. I never went to high school because I spent 18 years of my life as a competitive figure skater. I used to compete in Simsbury in the International Skating Center of Connecticut with Olympic champions and Olympic coaches. I chose figure skating over academics because I saw that as my dream. And, but when that dream ended, I had to find a new one, and I chose college. I want to get into a MD-PhD program for 2013. I spent 18 years of my life dedicated to this one sport, and it came to the year of the Olympics, and um, everything that could have gone wrong went wrong on that day of that competition. Like, my boot broke, my music wouldn't play. Like, it was so terrible. The next Olympics was another four years, and so I was like, I spent 18 years dedicated to this and then one competition kind of ruined my 18 years of training and so I was like it's not worth it. So at school if I worked really hard I could catch up with everyone else. All the stuff I learned in middle school I forgot that too and so to start college with no background in those subjects it was so much pressure. The first class I took was a math course, one class, and I spent like 10 hours or more a day on that one class. I wouldn't be anywhere without role models. I also see my father as a role model because he's a physician. He also believed in me when I didn't believe in myself. Mentors provide networks. They also provide support. You don't have to try and figure stuff out by yourself. There's someone that's been there, done it before, and you kind of can follow their road. One thing that motivates me is that I want to be a good mentor. If I don't make it, then how am I going to say that anyone can make it? And so. I want to be able to be that role model for somebody that wants to go into medicine or go do research and kind of want to do a little bit of it all.